what you're looking at isn't a prop from the next big blockbuster movie, nor is it some elaborate ancient stone carving. This is a real mummified dinosaur. Let that sink in. Say hello to Boreello Pelta Mark Michelai, a name as epic as the creature itself. Its story began not in a planned fossil dig, but completely by accident in a mine in Alberta, Canada. A miner stumbled upon something extraordinary. When paleontologists saw it, they were stunned. It wasn't just a skeleton, it was a nearly complete dinosaur, so perfectly preserved that it looks like it just laid down for a nap and never woke up. Most of the time, when we think of fossils, we picture dusty old bones pieced together in a museum. That's what makes this find so revolutionary. Boreello Pelta isn't just a collection of bones. We're talking about the complete package, the skin, the incredible armored plates covering its back, and even the remnants of its last meal still inside its stomach. Imagine that. We know exactly what this creature ate for lunch 110 million years ago. It was a fern-heavy meal, in case you were curious. This level of preservation is almost unheard of. It's like a biological time capsule sent directly from the Cretaceous period. The details are just mind-blowing. Scientists were able to analyze the fossilized skin and discovered actual pigment residues. This allowed them to reconstruct its true color. Boreello Pelta was a reddish-brown color with a clever form of countershading camouflage. Its back was darker and its belly was lighter. This helped it blend into the shadows and hide from massive predators like Acrocanthosaurus, the T-Rex of its time. Think about this creature. It was a heavily armored 3,000-pound herbivore, essentially a real-life land dragon roaming the ancient forests. Its body was covered in bony plates and shoulder spikes for defense, making it a formidable tank. Seeing Boreello Pelta makes the prehistoric world feel incredibly tangible and real, doesn't it? It's not just a theoretical monster from a textbook anymore. We can look at its face, its armor, its very skin, and almost feel its presence. It bridges the vast gap of 110 million years in a way few fossils ever have. What do you think when you look at it? Does it scream dragon to you? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this as amazing as I did, hit that like button and subscribe for more incredible stories from our planet's past. Thanks for watching.